Hi friends, welcome to my YouTube channel CS Baba. In this session, we will discuss about how to crack user login and logout detail in Active Directory 2022. So guys, we are going to cover Windows Server Active Directory 2022 Domain Controller where we are going to check the complete English every single steps to how can we track user login and logout detail. So guys, if you are first time viewer on my channel, please like, share and subscribe. So let's start. The steps we are going to follow, we are going to follow complete every single steps. So I will show to you, I am having here a Windows Server 2022, which I am having Windows Server 2022 a standard, which we are having. And this is my primary server domain controller. And I will show to you here, I am having go domain controller this dm.cpl this is my primary domain so i will going to create i will now i will going to create a one share folder with authenticated user with the authenticated user to say uh, local file c drive going to so control shift and just press and create a new folder uh, no so first step i will going to create a new folder in c directory or where you want you can also check with it most of the use most of the sys admin, admin and sys engineer save the login data inside c directory so i will going to create a folder in a folder or directory in folder in in c directory so i will assign the name log data with the log data log d a t a log data press enter so i have created one folder so right click over here and need to share with authenticated user. So go to properties, go to sharing, click to advanced sharing, click to check with the share folder, go to permission. remove this click to add type authenticated user a u t h e n t i c a t d authenticated users just yes, check name so here authenticated user ok press ok just check change apply so i have shared this log data with authenticated user of this with active directory 2022 so just close it first step i have covered so next step i will going to create a batch script inside the log log data so open notepad window R notepad open notepad notepad so I will going to create a script in batch file windows batch file so that type echo first is uh, I will going to create a login batch script then after I will going to create a log of batch file so echo echo will be print echo percent computer name name again percent space percent username username again percent space date and time and time again percent then Get to get then and where is what is the path of your share folder right click go to properties if you want if you remember you don't need to do this copy this path once you have copied this path go to the batch file press it here and what will be the name of this file script file again backslash 
and I will type here logi login dot txt. My all login details will be saved here in this file. Okay. Just you need to save this file inside the log data with authenticator. So save as go to all and type here login dot ba patch file just save it and close this go to inside the inside the log data so you have created one batch file script so again i will going to create one more batch file to log off so just press enter once open in notepad again you need to type echo echo space computer name name again person space user person user name person person date person space person time again I will going to track all the thing over here with computer name username date and time greater than sign and the path of a share folder log data and the login log of data file saving will be what will be the name so I will assign the name log of log log o f f t x t it will be saved in text format ok just click to save control s go to all file select all file and save as type log of data l o g o log log o f f dot batch file save this inside the log data once you have saved this in batch format i will show to you here these two file is saved at windows batch format extension is windows batch format so now i will going to jump on server manager go to server manager click to open server manager close this go to tools you need to group or gpu group policy management open group policy right click on your domain controller now i will going to create a new group policy to track user login and logout so create a gpu in this domain yes i am going to create just click to create then name which I am going to assign L O G log D A T A inquiry Q U I R Y whatever you want to assign you can assign it's up to you just click OK so you have created a new group policy now I will going to edit this group policy this policy I have created just right just go to right click go to edit press to edit so i am going to edit the group policy which we have created so my affection is going to change on user configuration there is no any config uh, computer configuration will going to uh, affect on only check on user configuration you go to user configuration select user configuration then policies click on policies then windows setting then script click to script so here you can check over here log on and log off go to properties click to properties and now you need to browse
click to add click to browse where is the batch file batch file you need to select the batch file path go to batch file select the batch file log data i will check on logon you select logon open with the extension which you have parameter if you want you uh, leave as it is okay then apply and save okay so i have attached share one script login script and i will same apply with log of it so go select the log of go to properties click to add click to browse select go to c directory and log data log of select the log of so once you have select the log of so you have selected log of or you can use like this log of you can use this like central go to go to properties sharing copy this go to properties again i will apply on log of just copy and log off log off so i have selected this part share folder path l o g log off path central this and press ok and apply ok so once you have applied so guys you can check over here go to again log on you need to rectify and check go to properties check here login dot bat the path is share folder path login dot bat batch file so i have assigned with user login script and now i will going to update the policy which i have updated to group policy close all the thing just again close go to close and you need to we open command prompt cmd run as admin so gp group policy update forcefully forcefully just press so i have updated the group policy so i need to check i will going to check user login oh, so i will show to you here open a user i will i am going to log in my virtualization hypervisor i will show to you here first i will going to log in my user and log out user these are the machine which i have running i will log in here and will be log out full screen username at password so i have login so just log out again sign out sign out back from the screen so 
I have once you you have a login and log out to user you need to go to the Windows Server Active Directory domain control open Active Directory domain controller go to directory C directory go to log data so you can check over here users whoever users you know, timing is this whoever user is logging and it will give you the complete details of login and logout how many users have login on that time and how many users have log off on that time yes you need to open the login just click on double click so these are the user login these are the user login with the name computer name it also computer name computer name you can check over here timing these are the timing the login timing all user login time so you can check over here these are you all user login time is coming i need to close this i need to check the log off you just open the log off so go to the log off so check here all user login and log out details if you want to check my name you can check over here search here you can check or might be i have you admin so you can check here this from this desktop this computer i have login and username timing so this guys this is the process to track user login logout detail in act windows server 2022 active directory domain controller so guys if you like this video please like share subscribe thanks for watching have a nice day